let's provide the solution to this problem square root of x plus okay plus x equals 6 so what do I do I'm going to put these two together and square them or oh, by the way take this to the other side first so that we have square root of x equal to 6 minus x and then square root of x equals 6 minus x I'm going to square this so that I can equally square this this would eliminate this and now x is equal to 6 minus x to the power of 2 from here what do I do remember that if you have a minus b to the power of 2 it is the same thing as a squared minus 2ab plus b squared right okay so we're going to have x here and it will be equal to a squared will be 6 squared minus 2 times 6 times b and our b is x then plus b squared is now x squared so we have x equals 36 minus 12 x plus x squared so now we have a quadratic equation and we can solve this okay before solving we have to rearrange this x squared will come first then we have minus 12 x this will become negative then this is plus 36 and everything is equal to 0 to continue with this x squared minus 13 x plus 36 is equal to zero now let's decide the formula to the method to use okay we can use the formula method for this and we can equally factorize this okay because when we use minus nine and minus four we can factorize because minus 9 times minus 4 will give us plus 36 and minus 9 minus 4 will give us minus 13 so this is okay for us so that we can get x minus 9 as one of the factors and then x minus 4 as one of the factors and both of them equal to 0 now x minus 9 is equal to 0 or x minus 4 is equal to 0 x is equal to 0 plus 9 or x is equal to 0 plus 4 and now from here x is equal to 9 or x is equal to 4 now let's put the two solutions together therefore x equals 9 or 4 now let's test the two values and see if it will be satisfying this equation the equation is square root of x plus x equals 6 so if we put 9 there it's already more than 6 right so it's not working because we have 9 plus 9 now this implies we're having 3 plus 9 because square root of 9 is 3 and this is equal to 12 so this is to say that x equal to 9 does not satisfy now let's pick x equals 4 we're going to have square root of 4 plus um plus 4 right and then um, this implies we have 2 plus 4 and 2 plus 4 is 6 
So this is to confirm that our x to be equal to 4 is the solution to the problem. Thank you for watching.